Uh, hey everybody, back with another video. Uh, it's on Percy, because he's new. And I just want to see if maybe we can get some strategy on him. Um, so Mind's Eye <laughs> pings her, uh, cane. So, I know where she is. And I found Mercenary, and I found Mind's Eye. Uh, she got a good pallet stun there. I was like, okay, nice pallet stun, Mind's Eye. Um... I'm, the reason I'm dashing here, even though it won't work, is because I'm trying to get my uh, energy state up. Uh, here I mess up again. I should have um, swung, so then I'd be immune to the pallet stun. But it's fine. Right now, she's doing... Uh, she's tight kiting. Right now, she's tight kiting really good. So see? No pallet stun. Break the pallet. Barely miss her there. Almost got her there. I was kind of sad about that. I clipped this wall on accident. So right now, Mind's Eye is doing a really good kite. She's tight kiting, not transition kiting. Right now, we're just, I can catch her here. So now she's down, and I teleport away. Don't swing at the perfume. I attack the get some uh, energy. I break the pallet. Hit the perfumer here. Go around. I figure she's transitioning as much as she could, but she goes back and she dies here. So now she's dead. I break this pallet. I wish Percy would get points for um, breaking pallets with the attack. He doesn't, so that kind of gets rid of some points. It also gets rid of points for uh, not sharing anybody. Oh, I found Mer I found mercenary here. Hard ca Percy's a hard counter to Merc, which is good because it'll change the meta rank, which is fun. He elbow pads here. And he goes into the basement, and I didn't see him. I'm like, wait, where'd he go? So then I'm just like, all right, I'll just leave him and go back for the mind's eye. I pressed the um, skill where I would attack again, but it didn't go. But I get her here. With the second skill. Break the connection. Figure prisoner would set it up, you know. Um, this match shows, um, one of, another thing of Percy's weakness, which is Cypher Rush. So I think on rank, oh, I teleport here, because I think they're healing, and I'm looking around, and then find Perfumer. But yeah, as I was saying, um, his counter is definitely, um, Cypher Rush. I do that to build up some energy. So, uh, in rank, I think banning mechanic will be the best thing. I go back to the mind's eye. Because she's almost dead, and I don't want her finishing this life. <laughs> she starts running away. Prisoner sets up a connection. I break that immediately. I figure, you know, with Percy's speed, I can catch up to where she's trying to transition to. I get stuck on the wall here, so I couldn't go through. And I get her with this. Barely recasting the time. Oh no, I did miss it, I forgot. It's because I didn't recast it in time. I have too much energy to so get rid of it. Break the pallet. Now she's dead. Right here, this is where my build comes into play. This is why I carry trump card. This is why. This is why I'm carrying trump card now. Because of this. Break the connection. Build up some energy. This. Abnormal comes into clutch in this match. If I didn't have trump card, 
I wouldn't be able to have normal, um, the stuff. So now they're all decoding over here. Hit mercenary. I go for the merc. Get stuck on this tree. Oh, uh, wait, no, I did give him up. I thought he was gonna camp the pallet. I thought I was close enough there. I guess it wasn't. He wastes his stun. So right now they're in a bad spot. Perf's injured. She'll die, I think, on death. Prisoner. See, he's not transitioning. He's trying to loot me as much as he can, because if he tries to go anywhere, he's dead. But he's dead either way. So I go back to the cypher. I get stuck on a dumb snowball. I break this power. Smack him down. Oh yeah, I think Merc, I see him, yeah, he's like going for the heal. Just smack him again, why not? I got a normal back, so I head over here. And I have normal this cipher again. See, I have normal save my ass. Uh, that's why I think... Hold on, I think I down prisoner here again. Because he's like too scared to transition. Down him again, yeah. This is, I think... I think this is Percy's best build. I mean, this, this is really working out. So a perfumer goes back for this. Get the stun. Cast it. Now she's dead. I figure Merc's gonna go for the prison heal. I'm right, but I head over there really fast. I go back for Merc. He uses his last elbow pad. But it doesn't matter, he's dead. Smack. I normally save this match. Because, you know, Mind's Eye and Prisoner, they rush the Cyphers pretty good. Depends, uh, and the reason they got the rush is because I couldn't down that Mind's Eye pretty fast. So right here, I go back. Because I'm like, I need to break the connection. And then my Abnormal comes back, so I kick it again. Get rid of my energy so I can dash faster. Like, if you want to cover more ground, and you have a bunch of dashes, and you're over energy, get rid of the energy, because you'll build it all back, because you're dashing again, look, safe, look, so. If I was at 50 plus energy, that would be a little slower, because every time I would jump in the air. I see this, uh, the, uh, his trail, so I th think he's gonna try and go around and I'm right. Don't get this here, but get him here. And that's GG's. Um, so this match shows the power of trump card and how much it can come to play. Like, if you don't need to have normal cipher, cool, just keep the teleport. But it's all about the potential. It's all about what if, and that's why I'm bringing trump card now. And it works pretty good. Um... As for this one point into Street Sweeper, you could put it into whatever else. Maybe you want to do this, Hunt. Maybe you want to do a Claustrophobia. Because there's nothing else to really put it into. Maybe Quenching. Maybe if they're rotating. Because there's nothing else to put it in. But yeah. Um, it's just a good, good match overall. It's pretty close. But I'll see you guys later.